goodness gracious. What's up, y'all? Y'all might wonder why I'm outside in a row at the resort. We've been having some technical difficulties, but thankfully, I got everything fixed and I'm able to resume vlogging. So it's late as hell in the day, but let's get this day started, man. At this point, this time I'm finna walk around this hotel because my phone and my phone company got me messed up. And I don't even feel like doing anything if I can't record it. Like, I'm not finna be recording on this Snapchat camera. And I got a whole phone, two phones. And I'm not fin I don't even want to put nothing up. Like, I can't record doing nothing. I'm finna go down to guest services just like this because this country got my phone messed up. I done paid supposed to be $10 a day to use my phone and I'm having to rely on Wi-Fi like how do y'all broke p excuse me <clears throat> I'm upset how do people live off of having to depend off of Wi-Fi to use their phone could never could never this skylight though listen y'all finna just get a vlog on this phone because on this snapchat if you got my snapchat you just tune in because listen I'm getting aggravated. If I go to this guest services in my pajamas and bonnet at a five-star res res resort, yeah, it's it's not giving because I want to record what I'm doing for my vlog and I can't do it. So thank you for coming to my TED Talk and letting me vent because I'm upset. I don't even got my glasses on. Listen, it's 1.40 and I ain't been out this hotel room yet trying to put this vlog together, trying to get content. And my phone is just not letting me record. I don't know if it's because I'm not having data, so it thinks that I don't have storage. Like, I done deleted all 6,000 of my... <sighs> Tomorrow's my birthday, and I need to get this figured out today because I don't need to be stressing. And I'm stressing. y'all y'all almost ain't get this vlog i was getting so frustrated but y'all saw that whatever it's real life things happen but now we finna get it popping now we finna go check out this resort and everything they have to offer and let's turn up my birthday's tomorrow let's turn up i'm finna get dressed and we finna turn up, okay? Let's start having fun, y'all. Let's start having fun. Outfit of the day. Look at all my rings. Rings from Shein. Body chain from Shein. Outfit from Shein. Waist breeze from Shein. Oh, y'all can't see my shoes. Shoes from Shein. Let's go see this resort, y'all. <laughs> I'm not even going to try to pronounce these names because <clears throat> I don't know how to say them. But let's go ahead and tour the resort because it was amazing. This is the first restaurant. So these are these are the restaurants at the resort. So at an all-inclusive resort, for those who aren't aware, like you b basically pay for everything up front. <clears throat> so every resort is different, though. The one I stayed at is the Majestic Mirage. And basically, you pay whatever you pay, and all the resort, all the restaurants on the resort, you can go to however many times a day. You can order some, let you order room service from them, and everything like that. Um, that first one was like a seafood. This second one right here is a hibachi. Um, so they have you know pretty good variety. 
Um, and for this one specifically, though, uh, for these first two, well, for I should say for my resort in general, you had to make reservations um, at at the restaurants or whatnot, because I guess depending on how busy the resort is and stuff, they either, you know, not all of them, you know, you have to make resorts at I mean, reservations at every resort, but at my resort specifically, you did for the more upscale restaurants. So there, they also had some just regular restaurants that had like served like American food 24 seven. You didn't have to, you know, have a reservation for that. Um, this is the third fancy restaurant and this one was an Italian. So they had a hibachi an Italian and a seafood um, those three specifically, you did have to have a, a reservation. And this one was my favorite. It was really pretty. Um, I didn't get a chance to eat at it because there was just so many restaurants and not enough time. And I was really just trying to do other stuff around the resort than just eat. So, <clears throat> but this one was really pretty. I really like it. And again, this is the Italian one. Um, so, yeah, just showing y'all around. Um, and then I went ahead and walked around like the rest of the resort. So this was kind of like their plaza area or where they would have like live music during the night. So but during the day they had I'm pretty sure these are like vendors that come out and, you know, everyone's here from all over. So they're just trying to sell their stuff. And he kept asking me, do I smoke or do I want Mama Juana or whatever? I should have bought one of those to put on my fridge. Um, but yeah, so it just has all types of little trinkets they put out. This is only during the day. They left every evening, probably like around seven or so. Um, but yeah, just has a whole bunch of different things that they made. And this guy over here was selling like clothes that he made and everything. So it was really nice. <clears throat> but yeah, I'll just let y'all go ahead and watch the rest of it. Um, I believe I'm going to go into the steakhouse next. Um, and yeah, so they had a whole bunch of restaurants, so I'm sure there's plenty more, but enjoy.
to y'all and i know y'all didn't get to see his face <laughs> but y'all i think i'm in love because baby i was gonna get them digits you feel me fold all three percent but you know we made it do what it do if you know you know Yeah.